Welcome to this week's video and today we are trying UK Duncan. I know you're probably like, Kamala, what? You usually do vlogs. Yeah, girl, but I want to do food content too. More because I just want an excuse to eat a bunch of food and I've honestly not really tried enough like American fast food that they do in the UK. So I was like, this is my chance. So I woke up this morning and I ordered an insane amount of stuff. Don't worry, I'm not gonna waste it. Cause I, I have my boyfriend here and he will be finishing off everything. So don't worry. I also woke up five seconds ago. I literally woke up and was like, time to film, time to order Duncan. And I was like, okay. So I already have enough energy. I do not need the caffeine, but it's fine. Um, if my hair is messy, that's why as well. And I'm literally wearing my pajama bottoms under this. Anyways, first things first, I got a box of six donuts. And what I will say about this is that all the flavors are different. Obviously, we got the basic strawberry and we got the basic, we got a few of the basics, but we also got all of the like new flavors that I've never tried before. A big reason I think that the drinks will be very different is because they don't use cream here and cream is like the biggest part of Dunkin' in America. Like my order is extra, extra, extra cream please. You know, I need that thick cream, but oh, that's what she said, sorry, sorry. No, they don't have that. So the coffees are definitely gonna taste different. Also, things just aren't as sweet here. Like, obviously if you go to a dessert shop, yeah, the dessert's gonna be sweet. But like, in general, like things are just not as addictingly sweet. Let me give you a haul of the drinks. First up, we have a regular caramel fudge frappuccino. Okay. Vanilla iced chai latte. I think we have that in the Dunkin' there, but I don't know if it's like slushy form like how it is here. Then I got my order, which is the French vanilla latte with some extra caramel syrup because again, they did not have cream. And cream is usually what I get with my lattes. So let me show you guys the donuts. Oh my God. These donuts look so much more gorgeous than they do in America. What? Oh, these are extravagant. No wonder they were expensive. I was like, why am I paying $35 at Dunkin' Donuts for six donuts and three drinks? Girl, it's because they look gorgeous. Just so I can show you guys up close, insert picture here. I say we start off with the beverage and then we'll get a donut in the middle of the beverages. Jay tape this up good. Okay, so first to start off the palette, I'll try my latte. I'm obsessed with these lattes at Dunkin' in America, so I will be able to tell the difference. <gasps> oh, that's good. Oh my god. Wait, I was not surprising that to be so good. That was not a real sentence. That little bit of a milkiness isn't there, obviously, because they don't do cream packets here, but it is still. Wow. I Next, we're going to try the fanciest one I got. This is raspberry white chocolate. This is putting me off because this tastes a little too fancy. Guys, this is too fancy to be Dunkin'. Wow, the filling is white chocolate, the icing is raspberry, but the icing being raspberry is such a strong flavor. And the fact that they have actual raspberry petals on it, gags, okay artist. Did you guys know that Dunkin' Bakers come in at like four, three in the morning, start making all the food for the day? Next up to cleanse the palate, who we will try our next drink. Next, we're gonna try the caramel frappe. Um, let's see if this is anything like good frappe. Mix, mix, mix. <gasps> this is like a smoky caramel. I'm very shocked. This is more like smoky. Like, it's not just like sweet caramel. It's like, there's like layers to it. I don't know what the Dunkin' here is doing, but this is fancy as hell. Wow. But this is how it tastes in America a little bit. Not exactly. I'm gonna go back to being a fatty the one I was most excited for Rocky Road also the reason I'm so infatuated by Dunkin Donuts is because in high school I had a bunch of friends that worked at Dunkin and we ended up going there every single day for about a year every single day we would literally fucking run that Dunkin like even though we didn't um work there like we would literally go behind ourselves and just get our donuts and just get make our coffees like because we were literally there every day we basically lived at the dunkin donuts like we would not only go after school but we would stay for like hours on end so bitch i know i know this shit anyways rocky road time smells very good
Mm. Now, I have a bone to pick with this one. The, the concept, the design is amazing. Because while it is very chocolatey, it's just given chocolate sweet. It's not given Rocky Road. It's not given Ice Cream Central. Let's just try, let's try one of the marshmallows on top of it. See, I'm not gonna lie. Oh, squishy squish. I'm not gonna lie to you, the marshmallows aren't really given much. Just to show you how sweet that chocolate Rocky Road donut was, I just sipped my coffee and it tasted not sweet. And it has six pumps of syrup. So, as you can see, the caramel frappe was a hit on that end of the room. The next drink I'm gonna try, which I'm very excited for, vanilla chai latte. Now, I'm a chai connoisseur. I love chai lattes. Um, but I don't get them as much because the place that I used to get them at sucks as a corporation. <gasps> oh. Mm. Mm. <coughs> wow, that was so good. Wow, this one tastes exactly like the American one. That was so good. I just needed a moment of silence with that one. Should we try another fun one? Should we go basic? Let's go basic for a second. Another chocolate, a chocolate monster. Let's see. Yo, that's just a chocolate donut. But I will say, I think I like the chocolate icing in America more. This is more dark. Very sweet, but darker, I would say. The next donut is gonna be Oreo. Now, I will be very critical of this because I love Oreo. First concern is why is it blue? That's not really going for the cookies and cream vibe, is it? Do you guys remember when Charlie Jamila was like the face of Duncan for like over a year? They like gave her like an at-home Duncan station. Do you think they still refill it for her? No. I'm gonna take a bite though where the cookies and cream is cause that looks phenomenal. Oh. So, here's my only thing I'm gonna say. Why is the cream on the corner side of it? Why is it coming on the corner side? First initial bite of the donut was not having it. I wasn't. Okay. Actually, I took a bite full of Oreo, tasted no Oreo. I was like, oh. But the cream on the inside, I don't know if this is placebo effect or what, but it genuinely does taste like Oreo, which I really, really like. And I don't like cream filled donuts. I'm just having them for you, but I need a break. Oh, how do the mukbangers do it? But you know what? I'm not even the biggest sweets person. I just want to try it out. If I was doing this video for like a ramen company or something, I would eat it. The next donut, which my favorite, the one I'm most excited for is this one, but it has a weird name. What was it called? It was called Speculus, but girl, it's just a Biscoff cookie. It's a Biscoff flavored cookie. Like, I love Biscoff. Mmm. Wow. Wow. They got that one on the dot. That tastes exactly like what you would think it would taste like. The weather in London today is not looking great. I know to you, it's just like a big white blob behind me. Oh, wow. Apparently, it's warm, but it is rainy. Usually, when it's rainy, I just assume that it's going to oh, be freezing. So the reason... I'm filming this for you guys is I did not have a vlog for this week whatsoever because I've been sick like last week I was like pretty sick I was just like in bed so my ass did not video anything next is strawberry glaze now I will rate the hell out of this it's different coloring very different coloring. I don't think they use red 40 here, right? Okay, we don't think that the UK is allowed to use red 40, which would explain how the pinks do look different. The sprinkles look very different. It's almost like, like look at the sprinkles, you guys. They're almost like very aesthetically like mute tones. Do you know what I mean? Like in the American one, it's like, oh, boom, bam. Hmm. The American one is a lot better. Yeah. Guys, I'm sorry, that's too bland for me. I'm, I need that red 40. No, I'm just kidding, but I need that like extra pizzazz. This is what we did today. This is the damage we did. Took a big bite out of everything. Don't worry. I have a friend coming over today. She will definitely eat some donuts. I have a man. I literally have nothing else to say except that's the video. That is the video. Wow, I'm not used to doing these type of videos. Usually I vlog throughout the whole week and then compile it. So it feels like I have so much content. Like I usually do like, a, like over an hour. 
this is like, girl, have I even been filming for five minutes? Like, I don't even, I can't even tell. I, I can't even tell you. Comment if you really like this video. Thank you for watching. Comment if you want to see something specific. Because, girl, I'll do it. Get it done before I get extremely famous like Emma Chamberlain, you know? Do all your recommendations now. I'm just kidding. Not really. But, um, anyways, yeah. So, thank you for watching. Bye. I love you. Stay gorgeous and hot and cool and perfect.